Sharks of the Gulf of Mexico. When you hear the word shark, what comes to mind? Maybe something like this? Or how about something like this? A great big dorsal fin coasting along the surface and just below the water, a ginormous torpedo-shaped body with large, extremely sharp teeth. These scary images are what most people think of when first hearing the word shark. But not all sharks look like this. As stated by National Geographic, there are over 450 species of sharks. Sharks are so incredibly diverse, ranging in size from the largest known fish on the planet to some so small that they could fit in the palm of your hand. Although there are over 450 species of sharks, only 49 species are known to inhabit the waters of the Gulf of Mexico. According to Dr. Bob Shipp, about 16 of these 49 shark species can be spotted along the coast of Alabama. These include the Atlantic sharp-nosed shark, which is very common in the shallow waters of the Gulf of Mexico and averages in size between 2.5 to 3 feet. The black-nosed shark, a quick swimmer, commonly feeding on small fishes like croaker and pinfish. The black nose reaches 4 to 4.5 feet in length. The black tip shark is Alabama's most common large coastal shark, which is commonly spotted along the Gulf State Park Pier. The black tip shark's average length is around 5 feet, but has been reported at lengths up to 8.4 feet. The bonnethead shark averages in size of 3 to 4 feet, but can reach lengths up to 6 feet. The bonnethead shark is one of the smallest members of the hammerhead shark family. The bull shark is a large, stocky shark that can reach lengths of 11 feet and can be found in both shallow waters, less than a meter deep, as well as deeper waters, up to 450 feet deep. The bull shark is capable of thriving in both saltwater and freshwater systems and can be found in brackish waters, like Mobile Bay, where saltwater and freshwater mix. The dusky shark is commonly a bottom feeder, but will feed on various types of fishes, eels, rays, and even other sharks. The dusky shark ranges in lengths of 8 to 12 feet. The fine tooth shark is named after its very small, fine, clear teeth. Fine-toothed sharks grow to an average length of four to six feet and are known to form large schools to hunt and feed on small bony fishes. The great hammerhead is the largest member of the hammerhead shark family, usually reaching an average length of seven to 10 feet and weighing 500 pounds. But this species has been recorded at lengths of 20 feet weighing over 900 pounds. The lemon shark is one of the larger species of sharks, reaching lengths of 8 to 10 feet. The lemon shark was named after its yellow, brownish color. The short fin mako shark averages in length of 10 to 12 feet and can weigh up to 300 pounds. Despite their large size, the short fin mako shark is one of the fastest sharks in the world, recorded at speeds of 20 miles per hour. These quick moving sharks are capable of feeding on other fast moving creatures, such as swordfish, tuna, and squid. The sand tiger shark lives in both shallow bays as well as waters up to 600 feet deep. These large sharks range in size from 8 to 10 feet. The sandbar shark is very common in the Gulf of Mexico, ranging in length from 4 to 7 feet. These sharks are more active at night and are considered bottom feeders, feeding on octopus, squid, crabs, and shrimp. The scalloped hammerhead shark is the most abundant of the hammerhead shark species, averaging in length of eight to 10 feet, although they have been recorded at lengths up to 14 feet. 
The silky shark ranges in size of five feet up to 10 feet. The silky shark is a very active and fast shark that prefers warmer waters, but can be found in waters over 1,200 feet deep. The spinner shark is named after its feeding strategy, breaching the surface and demonstrating a spinning leap as it chases its prey. Spinner sharks average in lengths of six to 10 feet. Lastly, the tiger shark is the largest sharks you will commonly see inhabiting Alabama's coastal waters. The tiger shark averages in size between 13 to 21 feet, but can grow much larger. Their teeth have evolved, allowing these sharks to feed on fishes, other sharks, turtles, birds, and sadly, even garbage that makes its way into Alabama's waters. Be sure to be on the lookout for some of the 16 shark species that inhabit coastal Alabama waters as you walk along the Gulf State Park Pier.